quality app or swap is available for download from the app stores. It's a really interesting app giving information about soil data and soil threats at any location in the world. In particular, it can show which scores are low for a certain location so that you can get management advice on how to improve soil quality. Squawk needs a location to work with. You have three options to set a location, typing a name or address, entering lead lawn coordinates, or simply by visually identifying the field of interest on the map. Once you confirm the location, the main screen of the app will open. There are four functional options. Only after running through the field characteristics, the recommendations will be available. The first characteristic screen shows the general environmental data available for the selected location that you can check and update. The land cover is particularly important as the options are more refined than the global data. The second characteristic screen fully depends on your input, about crops grown, pesticides used and type of management practices you are interested in. Upon clicking confirm you will return to the main menu where the recommendation screen is now active too. But let's examine the soil properties screen first. The soil properties overview screen shows the physical, chemical and biological global soil data available for your location. By clicking on the graph symbol, you can see how your soil compares to others with similar climate and soil type. You can also enter your own estimate, field measurement or lab result. Doing this replaces the global data in the algorithms to assess soil quality and produce recommendations. Moving to the soil threats overview screen, we see a list of soil threats for your selected location. Again, by tapping the graph symbol, you access the relative scoring function comparing your soil with others with similar soil and climate. Note that thresholds are set and the risk classified as low, medium or high using green, yellow and red as color codes. The fourth button in the main screen opens a summary screen showing you two scores the potential for soil property improvement and the overall soil threat level and lists the main indicators of each requiring attention. From here you can access the top 10 recommendations for your field. The I symbol on the left hand side gives you more information on the selected agricultural management practice and several examples that you can scroll through. The right hand side indicator symbol allows you to evaluate each recommended practice. Pressing next opens a screen where you can rank the recommendations that you have evaluated as interesting. The final two polling questions finalize a use cycle of SQUAP. Now you have returned to the main screen. Click more information to read up on various background topics. Or visit the Iscaparis SQUAP portal website for much more information. Music